Hello Capricorn, welcome to my channel Imrama Tarot. My name is Dipali. I'm a tarot card reader. I'm also a Reiki healer, a crystal healer and a manifestation coach. Let's start with the reading. Now in this particular reading, we'll be looking at your energies as well as your partner's energy. In case you are single, then we'll be looking at uh, the person you are interested in or if someone is attracted towards you or the person who is approaching you. Okay, this reading is for the next 10 days starting from 21st of May to the 31st of May. It's a general reading guys. Please take what resonates and leave what does not. You do not have to forcefully fit everything in your life uh, from this reading. Okay, let's see what universe has for you. Capricorn's energy for the next 10 days. Capricorn's energy. Capricorn's energy for the next 10 days. Capricorn's energy. Okay. Okay. Hmm. Let's see, Capricorn, what is your partner's energy? Capricorn's person's energy. Okay 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 so capricorn for your energy we have the devil queen of wands eight of cups okay and for your partner's energy we have the magician five of wands and nine of pentacles fair enough so um universe here is trying to tell us that um you are dealing with with some kind of uh, devil situation or like a temptation or some some um, addiction you are trying to deal with uh, this devil energy uh, is is probably a narcissist that you are dealing with uh, yeah it's a very specific message guys please take as it resonates it might um, I mean of course it will not resonate with all the Capricorns that are there on this planet but um, yeah you are sort of dealing with a narcissist who uh, who you know they they enjoy this off and on energy with you they keep on re-entering your energy circle they they never leave you permanently or they never let you leave them permanently it's like this on, on and off situation and they make you they make you crave for them they make you crave for them yes because see we have uh, we have queen of wands but then we have eight of cups as well queen of wands uh, shows a lot of determination here uh, where this person is ready for whatever is coming towards them with so much of warmth and vibration and determination but at the same hand we have abandonment as well self isolation as well um, you know this this feeling of um, restrict uh, restriction and putting yourself in a box so I feel I, I'm getting very uh, mixed emotions here, mixed feelings here because see in your partner's energy, I have the magician. The magician five of wands again tells us that there are couple of uh, disagreements happening, uh, disagreements, competition. See, this could be uh, someone who is already in your life or this person uh, could be someone walking towards you like on on his or her way to approach you but i i don't feel that this is a very good connection capricorn because this person will um this person will make you feel insecure okay not just once or twice but it will be like a continuous practice they will keep on making you feel insecure uh, because there are disagreements there is competition so they might compare you with their with their um, other female friends male friends whatever the gender is uh, they might compare you to their ex a lot and um, and you know like um, I, I, I can feel the emotional manipulation they will not say that my ex used to love me more than you do no in fact the exact opposite they will say that my ex did not used to love me the way you do and you know this emotional manipulation would be uh, so that you fall for them not just like uh, you know not just like liking liking but you start thinking that this is a soulmate connection and oh this person 
appreciates that I love him and you get that validation from this person that you are looking from somewhere else but you get it from this person and you think that this is your soulmate but no this person is not this is a devil you are dealing with a devil who um, makes you crave for them you are a queen of wands here and they have in their energy they have nine of pentacles which means material comforts so maybe they are with you to enjoy the material comforts that they get from being with you okay let's see what we have from the love and connection deck universe capricorn's energy for the next 10 days universe capricorn's energy for the next 10 days Okay, Universe Capricorn's Partners Energy for the next 10 days. Universe Capricorn's Partner Energy for the next 10 days. Hmm. Okay, so for your energy Capricorn I have, there is a deeper reason for each of your questions. Seek it. I feel um, Capricorn to some extent you are already aware of the fact that this person is playing with you your emotions uh, manipulating you but uh, you know you have certain set of questions but then because of the validation that you need from this person you are unable to put those questions like <clears throat> in front of this person uh, even in fact you are not even um, wanting to uh, talk to your own self regarding these questions you don't want any answers for these questions because once you'll start looking for answers then probably you'll have to ask this person to just get lost and you don't want that because then you'll be left all alone so yeah the second card is you are destined for greatness on the wings of love all there is to love has been there all along capricorn i feel um here the universe is talking about self-love you are very emotionally vulnerable right now and that is why you have fallen a prey to this person Yes, you are very emotionally vulnerable right now and we have to, um, right now the universe is indicating us to focus on self-love. I feel um, self-love has been there all along as in the, the indication from the universe uh, to love yourself has been there all along but you just were not doing it you were just not listening to the universe's um, clues and hints and indications you are destined for the greatness on the wings of love this is not the relationship guys i feel this is not the connection that um, you deserve for this person's um, energy we have create space for new love keep it simple love in spite of it all i feel capricorn this person <coughs> sorry this person does not um, believe in keeping things simple even though we have a card of keeping keep it simple but i guess that is uh, something that universe wants them to work on because they don't keep things simple they just complicate things a lot and they just they have this such a bad energy okay um and for them love is the only thing love is the only thing no other emotional attachment or like a physical attachment or maybe mental health for them love is the only thing maybe they are very possessive if if not a narcissist then maybe they are very possessive because see i i can i can see that they are um, they are very yes they are i think addicted to you and this addiction is is causing you trouble maybe in your professional life or personal life and um, you know you you are in a connection you are with this person but then also there are times when you feel alone you feel that this person is not there like present in this particular relationship yes i feel this person is extremely possessive and they they um how do i explain this they don't give you space they just don't give you space so that is all that i have for you capricorn please let me know if you liked it in case you did hit the like button comment share also if you resonated with my reading if you like 
how I do my readings then please subscribe to my channel Imrama Taro I'm trying to build my channel here guys so you can support me and my journey in the form of subscription or in the form of donation whatever you find convenient whatever suits you the best okay so yeah that's all be kind stay happy see you next time bye